All right, hi everyone. Uh, here we have our main panel, and as you can see, the breakers are already populated in the panel. Um, the breakers won't necessarily be in the same order that uh, in every single panel. You'll have to find the ones that you're using. For the first week we're tying the breakers, you're going to be using the 15 amp breaker, a single pole 15 amp, and that's what it is right there. When you strip the wire to go in the panel, you should be stripping uh, a little over a foot. I would maybe go foot and a half. Um, you know, 18 inches, somewhere around there. And you're gonna be using one of these connectors. So this is a 4004 gray connector. These gray connectors will fit in one of the holes in the bottom of the panel. So I'm gonna bring you over here so you can actually see. So all these little holes in here are half inch holes. Some of them are knocked out a little bit larger for a three quarter inch uh, connector. Uh, but the 4004, the gray connectors, just slide in through the bottom like this and you'll be able to put them in no problem. You should not have to punch out any more holes. Uh, these panels have a ton of holes in them already. So once you have the ray connector in, the 404 in the panel itself, you're gonna push in the wire that you've stripped from the bottom up through the connector itself till you get to the white insulation portion and that should be sticking out roughly about a quarter of an inch. We're going over here again so you can see. So it should be sticking out roughly a quarter of an inch. Uh, at that point, my recommendation for you is to separate the wires, and I always work with the bond wire first, and I'll put that, tuck it nice and neat in the back of the panel, set it to the length I need, or get it all, all uh, tucked into the back corner, get the length I need, use my uh, cutters, cut the wire to the length, and then you'll be able to slide the wire under the bond bar under the screw and I'm going to over and show you that now. So you can see the wire is tucked nice and neat in the back and it goes into the uh, bond bar down at the bottom there with the screw tight. The last wire we have to put in is the hot wire, the black wire here. And for that one we have to find the right type of breaker. The breaker we're using in the first lab here is a single pole 15 amp breaker. So again, this is one of the ones that I that is a single pole 15 amp. They won't necessarily be in the same order as in this panel. This is just an example. Um, but you basically do this the same way you did the white wire. Make a nice little small loop and go up nice and straight into the bottom of the breaker. Hold your thumb there where you need to cut it. Strip the wire and then you'll be able to stick the wire in the bottom of the uh, breaker just like this and you'll be able to tighten that up. You should only be using a Red Robertson to tighten up that breaker. Anything else uh, can potentially uh, damage the uh, breaker itself. And this is kind of what that looks like. So you have the wire coming in, breaker, uh, and the black wire is basically hooked up to the breaker right there. Give everything a little tug just to make sure nothing falls out and you are good to go.